Park. Yes. Let us see what we have. What is the derivative of sine? Derivative of sine is cosine, yes? Right or wrong? Yes, derivative of sine. We took it in chapter 6, differentiation, yes? Derivative of sine is cosine, the opposite. What the integration of cosine? Integration of cosine is what? Yes, thanks. Integration of cosine is sine x. How we check our answer? Maybe wrong, maybe right. Let us see. What is the derivative of sine? The derivative of sine is cosine. Sine is indefinite integral to cosine. Sine is original function to cosine. Yes. Let us see now uh, rule number one. The integration of AX in ministry exam, sometimes the power of X not linear. Here we have how many conditions? Two conditions. What is the first condition? We have cosine. What is the power of cosine? One. What is the power of X? Also one. We, this form in a standard form. Since it is in a standard form, so the integration of cosine is sine ax over a. a is the derivative of what? Angle plus c. What the integration of sine? Integration of sine is minus cosine ax over a. If we find the derivative of minus cosine ax over a, we will get what? Yes, we will get sine ax because derivative of minus cosine is minus 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 sine to be positive. Now, how many conditions? Two conditions. We must have what? We must have what? Yes, we must have two things. What? Power of cosine is one and the angle is what? The power of the variable also is one. Now, same thing with sine. If we have secant or cosecant, we change it to what? To sine or cosine? Now, evaluate the following integrals. Question number A. Cosine, yes. Cosine. What is the power of cosine? One. Thanks. What is the power of variable x? Is also one. The first term is in standard form. And we have addition also. The second term is what? Sine. The power of sine is what? The power of sine is one. And the power of the angle x also one. So we can integrate direct. There is no need to use substitution method. Champions, what the integration of cosine? We change cosine to what? Sine. Pi x. What is the derivative of pi x? Pi. In derivative, we multiply by pi. In integration, we divide by pi. What the integration of sine 3x? Integration of sine 3x, it will be negative. Negative what? Cosine 3x divided by what? Thanks. Divide by what? By 3. Because the derivative of angle equal 3. Now, we take another question. 3 over secant. Secant? No need to secant now. We change secant, yes. What is the formula of secant? Who will answer? I will answer. Secant means 1 over cosine, yes. What is the meaning of cosecant 5x? Cosecant 5x, 1 over what? Sine 5x. 
upset down. What the meaning of upset down? It will be a cosine. It will be h up. Then three cosine two x. Same things with sine five x. Sine five x upset down. It will be what? Sine five x. R. They in a standard form? Yes, because we have addition or subtraction and the power of cosine is one and the angle of cosine also one and the power of sine is one and the power of angle is also one linear equation this complete i no you you can you are champion you can you can do it a tangent tangent for x number c tangent for x we change Tangent. What is the meaning of tangent angle? Yes, try the best. Tangent angle is sine angle over what? Over same angle. Thanks. Multiply by cosine 4x. We have cosine 4x up in the numerator and down. We can cancel cosine 4x with Go sine four x. What is the remaining? Sine four x. Sine four x in a standard form. Why? Because the power of sine is one, and the power of x in the angle also one. What the integration of sine? It will be negative. Yes, negative what? Cosine four x over four plus c. Thanks. Let us see, we took the rules before, we have an idea about the rules, we have four rules, multiplication, and we took before, if we have multiplication, we try to change it to what? Addition or subtraction. But a limit, we change addition or subtraction to what? To multiplication. Now, multiplication, now have sign the sum of two angles plus when sign before cosine, if we have cocktail, sine and cosine, the result always sine. And sine A plus B plus sine a minus b when sine before cosine the miss sign is what positive if cosine before sine then the miss sign is what negative now we have also formula have sine a we get sine all, all always if we have cocktail cosine and sine sine the sum minus sine the difference between angles yes let us cosine cosine if they are same we will get same cosine cosine we will get cosine cosine if they are both cosine then between them addition the last one sine sine negative half all of them positive except the last negative half cosine cosine what cosine addition minus cosine what cosine subtraction let us see about integration now ev evaluate the following integrals Evaluate the following integrals. We have sine, cosine, cocktail. The power of sine is one, and the angle also one. And we have multiplication, cosine. The power of cosine is what? One. And the power of x in what? In, in angle also one. We try to change what? Change multiplication, yes. Multiplication to what? 
to addition or subtraction. We have formula. This is A and this is B. We have formula half. Sine A plus B plus sine A minus B. What the meaning of A? A 5x. What the meaning of B? 3x. If we add 5x to 3x, we get what? 8x. If we subtract 5x minus 3x to get what? 2x. Now, we have addition or subtraction. Addition we have between the two terms. Now, what the integration of sine? The half as it is, what the integration of sine? Cosine 8x over 8, yes, minus. What the integration of sine? Minus cosine 2x over what? 2 plus c. Thanks, champions. You can, yes. Let us see. This is b cosine 3x seek. Seek, we change. Change what? Change. We change secant to what? To 1 over cosine. We took it before. And upside down, it will be multiplication between cosine, cosine, cosine what? 3x cosine x. Now, if we have multiplication, we change multiplication to what? To addition or subtraction. We change it to addition or subtraction. Please do it. You can. You are champion. You can. Let us see formulas. If we have even powers, what? We have odd and even. If we have even powers, so we change it to h power 1. The formula sine square ax equal half 1 minus cosine a twice angle. What? Twice angle, yes. Twice angle, if it is ax, it will be what? 2ax. Same things with cosine square. When we use the two formulas, we use it when the power is even. And we have sine or cosine. The formula of half, sine cosine square, half, 1 plus cosine twice angle. Let us see, evaluate the following integrals. Question number one, dx over secant square. Yes? What is the meaning of secant square? Secant square means 1 over cosine square. 1 over cosine square, we make upside down. Now it will be cosine square 3x. Cosine square 3x is the angle is linear yes the power of x1 is the bar is even yes we use the formula half 1 plus cosine twice angle twice angle we have the angle 3x twice angle means what we multiply the angle by what by 2 yes now all terms in a standard form. What the integration of 1? One? 1 is the derivative of what? 1 is the derivative of x. Yes. What the integration of cosine? We can integrate cosine because the power of cosine 1 and the angle is linear. Integration of cosine is sine 6 x over 6. Thanks. Thank you for listening. Thank you your, for your focusing. You are champions. I trust you. You can do and you can. And if it is the will of Allah, you can 
uh, do your homework and if it is the will of Allah we will see you again in another video thank you for listening wassalamu alaikum